So I'm sure that you're here because you've seen the caption. You've seen the actual thumbnail. I'm sorry. Yeah. It is so annoying when you have your TV or something be rubbed, something fall on it, something hits it, paint gets on it. So I'm glad that you came to this video because I'm going to show you how this technique that I'm going to ready to show you in this video is so simple that you can literally use this on your computer screens, your tablets, your flat screens, your MacBooks, all of the things that can get white smudge paint look like it rubbed across it this right here is going to show you so if it works for you talk to me in the comments and if i saved you some coins or save you some agony talk to me in the comments because that's what this channel is all about helping you to get the things done that sometimes seems like the impossible but it's not so you came to the right place enjoy the video later gators hey my gators you ever had an issue where something with an electronic that is black it fell or hit the wall or got scraped up or something like that i did it also for my tv my daughter's tv in her bedroom it's a huge tv and somehow the screen got these white marks from paint and also around the frame and let me show you how i got it off simple and easy the angle might be a little weird but all you're going to need is some alcohol now if it's a higher concentrate alcohol i would recommend 50 or 70 70 you might have to put a little bit of water but if it's 50 it's already 50 percent diluted don't worry about it you want a cotton ball you want to put you a little bit of alcohol on a cotton ball and you want to have another rag right away because soon as you wipe it you want to wipe with the dry rag so that the alcohol doesn't eat the finish of your electronics this works for tvs this works for anything that's black that's electronic all this is is alcohol so we're going to take oops and we're going to drench that with some alcohol and we are going to wipe wipe no remover guys you don't need remover and take a cloth and come right behind it Take a cloth and come right behind it. Even the buttons have um, white stuff on them. My camera's acting funny. I had to zoom in. I'm going to wipe the buttons as well. So this is showing you how some of those TV frames have that shiny, glossy look on the side of them. If you get to where someone is moving the TV and something falls off the wall or the TV hits the actual wall and you're like, oh my gosh, see, this is going to be... Um, up on a, a mount so you're not going to see that but i wanted to be able to share this with you look the marks are gone and it's, it's drying up and you see it evaporating or you can just go in there and just wipe it out with a dry rag some of the liquid got in the button so i want to make sure i get all that out and let that do its thing and then we're going to go back to this back area these are literal things that will not come off okay alcohol that's all you need guys alcohol i also did a video on how to get wax off your screen tv i'll link that down below but this is the stuff that i know is going to help you because we all have electronics that you invest in and stuff and you definitely don't want to uh be frustrated because now you have damaged it or it doesn't look as good especially if it's something that you can see i won't see this once i hang it up but why not show you how to do it with something i can see i just had to move my headboard and literally hit this knocked it off the frame and all that other stuff so now all of it is gone we got a little bit right here and we're gonna just take our cotton ball and wipe 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 and it's gone that is how you get the white paint smudges and scratches off of off of your electronics all right so i'm about to change my sheet and everything i got stuff all on the bed from trying to mount this back up i had to put some um anchors in because it literally fell out the wall so all right guys later get up